This question was asked by the BG Singh and in this question we asked for the Muru type FSM okay and that is overlapping type and we have to detect a pattern where uh, number of one is more than one in last three samples okay they have also given one example for uh, this input uh, whatever the input stream it is given here corresponding to that that output stream should be there okay so for this one what we have to do first of all i am going to break it down this problem in the two step first i am going to be design a mili type fsm okay and after that i will convert into the mili type fsm so in this problem not you only under, understand the solution of this problem also you will learn about the how you can convert into the mili type fsm into the mili type fsm all right you have to understand that in three samples okay three samples are you have to be taken to check it out and uh, for that you have number of one is greater than number of one okay so suppose there are this uh, we have to find it out all the possible solution okay so this is zero one one this is the one solution where you will get output one okay and this is one zero one okay this is the one another way one one zero okay so this is the another way and this is the one 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 so if you will consider three samples where the output can be one these are the four possible combinations okay you have to be check it out for that you have to design the first uh, fsm okay so again i am saying i am first going to design a mili fsm i will then i will convert into the muri type fsm and simply i need to put one more state and i can easily get the answer okay so first of all uh, how you you will be three states are required so three state is okay but one is initial stage is required okay uh, where the everything will be started so initial stage suppose we will uh, consider uh, this is state a i am going to be put the name okay i am going to put the name a b c d okay so these three states are to check it out the sample these are the reset state okay uh, yeah, uh, starting state starting state okay so from where we will check it out okay so let start with this thing okay so first of all we have to understand we have four states okay a b c d okay and uh, first of all we have to check it out we have to find it out whether uh, we have to check it out uh, uh, these all four combinations okay yeah it should be there okay if it is zero is there it is going to be retained at the same position okay if uh, zero is there this is going to be zero by zero okay always remember that when you are talking about the fsm this is going to be an input okay and this is going to be output and this is your state so oh, it means that uh, if you are at this state it means you are at the reset state only so in this uh, whenever you are making the mili machines so keep in mind that whenever you are writing zero by zero it means that first number is your input and second one is your output okay come back to the next state okay if it zero is coming it is going to be written at the same state okay and if one is coming then it will be moved to the next state okay? look at b so what happen if uh, if it is reaching up to the b it means that uh, you you are reaching up to the one okay ab now check it out if one is coming so it is going to move forward okay with output one so if one because uh, two inputs are coming now if uh, at state b one is already there and if another input uh, one is coming over here again like this then output is going to be one because only two uh, one is required in nine three samples and in the first two samples it is coming so it will become like this only at the c state with output one okay and suppose if zero is coming okay so uh, again we will check it out with c uh, uh, first we will draw the correct pattern okay again if c is there and one is coming how where it is going to be if c is coming one is there then it is going to be written back to its state okay na because three samples are come and it is it get overlapping one 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 and we can overlap them okay so we can overlap for this here only for last two samples only so we can get overlapping over here okay and now so again if you are coming here one one over here again you if one is coming uh, zero is coming it will be moved to the uh, this uh, d state okay so what exactly this mean one one zero is there if it is reaching like this after reaching uh, d so there is uh, one another possibility is there if uh, input is coming via c it is going to be one one zero okay it might be possible it will be directly reach from b to d okay 
why because uh, whenever zero is coming zero one zero okay so zero output zero out, output is going to be zero only if it is reaching at the d state so zero one zero it is it may be possible there okay so uh, like this it can also come so whenever you are reaching at the state d and uh, you have to another sample will come out okay if a sample is coming next sample is coming zero so how what is the possibility g one zero zero okay that is the possibility if one is coming so that this is going to be uh one zero one okay like this it will come so if zero is coming start from the zero because uh we have to be uh because overlapping is there and we have to be sampled from there only so if zero is coming it will be written back to this one zero by zero okay if one is coming over there okay if one is coming there one uh, one zero uh, one who so if it will come there you can overlap from there only okay so you can overlap from like this from here one uh output one okay like this you can do so in this way you can form the melee machine okay to convert this uh, entire melee machine into the mure machine what you have to do you have to find it out the states okay at a output is going to be zero okay b you just check it out output is zero okay whenever come c output is coming one one okay one is coming whenever output is coming to the d there two outputs are coming whenever it is coming to the uh, things are coming to the d one is one and uh, one and another is zero okay so two outputs are coming over there so you, wh where output is going to be different you have to put uh, uh, every state is written with the help of the output and keep in mind that every state having only one output that's why we have written two okay this is the d state only with output one and this is the d state only with output zero okay so now come back to the a whenever a input is going to be zero it is going to be written at a okay like this you will write simple here now output is inside the s1 box again if uh, one is coming you need to be shift to the b state okay again b whenever you are at the b just check it out here if you are at the b if zero is coming it will go to d with output zero keep in mind that d with output zero and again if b is zero then d with output zero this will, will go like this one so, and, uh, and if one is there it will be moved to c if uh, one is coming from here one is coming it will goes to the c now come back to the c whenever c one is there it will be goes to again at c only okay because it is going to be written at the same state one is there again if uh, zero is coming then output is going to be one keep in mind that here output is going to be one then it will be moved to this state okay whenever zero is coming over here okay and again check it out now come back to the d0 state okay whenever d0 is there whenever d0 is there when uh, then it means that you are reaching somewhere here uh, d0 means uh, 0 0 0 0 okay you are coming here as 0 and uh, if uh, 0 is coming you need to be written back to d0 is there then you need to be written back to 0 only okay and if uh, one is coming at this state okay coming then we can overlap from one over here okay we can count one from here so this is something one okay again if uh, uh, if d1 is there d1 it means if it, uh, it is reaching up to here so this is uh, output zero this is one this is one one and this is going to be again uh, this uh, it means uh, one one zero it is there so if one one zero again zero is coming then where we need to be start from zero only okay again we need to be start from zero here only from zero if input is coming zero if one one zero one then again we start to from b only okay b only like this so in this way you can make the so more image. this entire thing i redraw it in a much simpler manner like this okay so this is the same thing whatever i have done this thing i just simplify i just put it here only and this state i have put it like this so that arrows can be easily readable in the readable form okay and uh, again uh, you can just make it sure that uh, this is the appropriate diagram but i usually write it uh, down this uh, for my own convenience it means uh, uh, where I am going to be, I am reaching here. So, zero one zero, zero one zero, like this. 
so uh, you can make it in your own convenience okay so if uh, any doubt is there any issue is there uh, try to understand this thing because it required a little bit basics uh, before uh, going through this one so direct uh, if you don't have idea about what i am drawing and you are not able to understand so first go to the basics then you will try to understand these things because this is little bit complex okay so hope you will understand this thing